myself what's good what's good but i ain't doing nothing literally um y'all know i had got my hands done in the lab or whatever but i wasn't able to really do nothing yesterday so i ended up not i had a flight today my flight was supposed to leave today i thought it was leaving wednesday so i just went ahead and paid for it to be extended on the extendo bitch and then um literally right now i'm just going over to the chinese spot and give me a tea because them bitches act like they had an attitude last time so I don't want no food, but I just want a tea. And then tonight I'm getting a little night cat. Night cat, because I'm getting sexy. So y'all like my hair? Mm. I ain't put this DMC boat on for the fucking feds. Get me. That's how small our town is. I go get a slice of fucking bread and this bitch ass nigga. I was stalking her. You wasn't stalking was, me nothing. What's up, baby? What's good, man? What I can't doing? call it. Hey, I was stalking you. You little thick ass. What you doing? Tight ass shirt. Okay, I just shake myself up. Why ain't don't you cut my hair yet? But when I go to other life. niggas and get my shit cut, you be mad as fuck. I'm gonna do it right later. No, I'm going to oh, get a. I'm going to the shot. hotel and do a nightcap. What? I was at the hotel all night, had a little nightcap. Who you waiting for? None of your business. Damn, I'm sitting in line. Oh, I'm gonna sit right here and wait for you then. Uh, Who the fuck you waiting for? Come on, yo, you need to get up out of here. <laughs> Who the fuck you it's waiting like, on? Nah, I'm waiting on Quante. Quante who? What other Quante do you know? Bitch, I don't know nobody. I was stalking you though, for real. You I fucking GP was. I got GPS on your mama car. I'm gonna tell my mama that she need to change her shit. They miss well, you. They said it's 50 seconds to be on the vlog I'm today. My, I'm dropping a mixtape soon. We don't Solo. give a fuck. I'm just saying. Don't be on here promoting your shit, nigga. You better pay me. I Run me you. my motherfucking yeah. money. Run me my... What the fuck he about to pull out his pocket? Bitch ain't got nothing but a fucking lot of receipts. That's like a million. Did you win? Because you only put up a dollar. Mm -mm. Did you win, bitch? Nah, they at least got to be $2. So We're quant. No, -uh, that bitch say a dollar. Well, that's that's not the right one. That is, it says a dollar. I said pick four, too. It it's says a dollar. Mega million. Two dollars. <laughs> Why the fuck is you stalking me? Because. I'm going you. on a date tonight. I'm going Look, the to other it. night, I told you to come to the hotel because I was fucking this little bitch. I was. Huh? I'm bodyguard. Well, you wasn't coming to fuck her, but she was coming for support. The support? What I was going to watch? Bitch, don't violate me. I'll smack the hell out you, ho. You said coming for support? I was without support. You little bitch. Where's she at now? You really seen me when I went to Chinese spot? Or you I, didn't see me I then? I followed you. Where are you following me from? You know where you coming from. Where the fuck I come from? <laughs> you know where you coming from. <laughs> I do. Where did I, I come I, from? I ain't, gonna, I ain't gonna tell the followers. I ain't gonna put you out there. You can put me out there. I don't give a she fuck. She coming. <clears throat> Shorty been creeping, man. She ain't shit, man. Where the fuck she I'm coming back, from? She come back. She came home on the shore just to fuck around, man. <laughs> she been hoeing all since she been here. That's why y'all ain't seeing me. <laughs> That's why y'all ain't seeing me. Oh my god. I gotta get on Instagram oh live. <laughs> why the fuck you lying? Who? One of the blue pants. What you just yeah, fuck you? Yeah, that bitch like an old ass woman. Yo, I ain't never met no hater like that. This nigga was fucking. Oh, I gotta throw my fucking wig off now. The fuck? Tell them, hey, they they said it's 50 Cent gonna be on the vlog today. I didn't what think. Up, I, man, 50 here. You I wasn't me? worried about seeing this bitch. You know what I mean? I wasn't worried about seeing her, but I seen this blonde. I thought it was an Asian. <laughs> but I said, hey. Como tale vu? <laughs> Bitch, that's not even <laughs> fucking Chinese. I said Como tale vu is I'm speaking Korean. French. Oh. No, I'm sorry. <laughs> I my language. What the hell cold. is wrong with you? Everything. It's hot cold. But I'm not. I'm going to fuck on some little hood night, so. Can I come? 50. What the fuck you going to do? Hey, miss. Thank y'all. 50 cent yeah. in the building. 50 cent. Where are your friend? I store. haven't seen him in years. He sent his um big mom some money. He sent her some money. No, but she didn't want to accept it, so he's gonna get it back. For real? Yeah. Damn, she on her bullshit. 
Hey, yo, y'all follow me too on the gram, man. Fuck you, nigga. Deuce a milli. D a milli. You really miss me? Yeah, scoot over. I'm not scooting the fuck over for you to break my mama fucking car. Man, scoot your big ass hips Why over. Why don't you just Damn. get on the other side, bitch? You always want to be next to me. You can get over here. <laughs> this bitch always calling me thick. <laughs> <laughs> she got the fucking nerve to be talking. Look at me. <laughs> Shit like Miss Piggy. <laughs> now your bitch ass ain't getting in. Damn! I thought you got me. I'm gonna sit here anyway and see what Quante did when he see the, my car started and I ain't in there. And don't you know her? She got her heels on. You know you're the baddest thing on the yeah. shore. No, I'm huh? the baddest out. Yo, ugly ass. What's up, fuck? You gonna call me Miss Piggy, bitch? My bitch the baddest out on the wizzy dog. Who is your bitch? Huh? You don't even got a bitch. Who's don't your bitch? That. Don't worry about that. Don't worry about that. It's a lucky one out there. There he is. Oh, shit. Oh, what you gonna do? Just chill like that. He gonna call me on my phone in the car. Oh, should I say hey to him? Not yet. Oh, he looking around too. He looking around. He gonna know we in here, cause look at you. You ain't little to hide. Oh, he don't see me. He thinks he might beat you up. Shut the fuck up. Look how he looking around for you. He's shook like a bitch. <laughs> Watch him call my phone. Stop, stop, stop. Yo, you're stupid. He can't see her, can he? Bitch, she ain't got no tits. She a mom. <laughs> what the fuck did that mean? <laughs> my phone will die on some dumb shit. Do you want me to cut your hair later? Uh-uh, I'm gonna be at the hotel being nasty. I'm what, getting what? these yams ate, the fuck? Get a hotel where at? I can't tell you all my fucking business and these Man, people so they can pop crazy. the fuck up on me. She I'm trying crazy. to be nasty. I'm to... Listen, I'm ready to start a YouTube channel. Bitch, suck a dick. Glamazon, Glamazon Deuce. The journey of, journey of, um. Something's wrong with you. I'm okay. starting my page, Glamazon Deuce, all right? Shut up. Damn, that white girl dick. Don't you dare change to the culture. You better go watch Black Panther the, before I smack the hell out of you talking man, about that white girl dick. What's wrong with you, nigga? Dick ass, get out of here. <laughs> <laughs> you need to go. Where are you going? Where are you I'm going? going to hell if I'm never right. Don't we look like? I look like her daddy, because that's who I got. Bitch, you is never. I'm her, I'm her daddy. I mean, I'm her grandpa. <laughs> hey, y'all. Damn, y'all need to be on my live when I go live. Shit, must should be him. But you not me. Shut up. Get up out my ear. You wish you trying to put my shit out? Go ahead, cause no, I'm slick. But... Bitch, get off. I done <laughs> took down and secured this shit. Somebody said twins. You know we look alike. Only I'm just smaller. We out here thugging, man. We out here on the shore thugging where bodies get dropped every fucking day. It's like I'm lying. <laughs> <laughs> Only thing they died is who the fuck fly. is dying out this bitch? Uh -huh. Um, I gotta go. And I'm not getting my hair cut by you because you just too sore. Right, so. come on, y'all. I told y'all I was gonna call you when I got back on this end. Tell your mom made me some cookies. Too. No, because I'm gonna go be nasty. I'm not worried about you, my mama making you no damn cookies. I'm gonna get this gams ate. These yams ate. You get on my fucking nerves, bro. We're gonna get these yams bye, ate. Bye, 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 snap. Love y'all. Mm, 50 cent. Did to tea, you net. <laughs> oh my god, this legit made me. This legit made me feel some type of way. So I I don't know why. But okay, y'all know I just seen 50 cent, whatever. So I was just literally looking on Instagram. And it was this couple I remember from like like a long time ago, like maybe 2013, 2014. And they're like having twins now. And I was like, oh my God, they're having twins. And then I'm just sitting here like, damn, like they're having twins and they've been together since 2014. And I just be thinking about like people I used to talk to, I'm like, what the fuck? If I was still talking to those people, like where would I be at now? I mean, I guess I should be appreciative in the life that I have right now. But sometimes don't it make you wonder, like when you see couples that like started, well, I was dating person before, 
this couple got together because they got together 2013 14 other people like before them was like you know 2008 and 9 and i just feel like what if me and that person like really could have got it together even i know you're not supposed to think like that but it just be making me feel like you know a little weird just a little bit but i have to say you know god has a plan for me and um everything happens the way they're supposed to like i just seen one of my classmates in the store and she had twins and like i said this couple right here is having twins and i just be like like bitch how are you living your life i mean i guess i'm living my life but still just be passing in my head people think like it's so weird people that want success um I'm not saying you can't have both because you can but it's most more so it's like you always want you can't have like i think i kind of got a, a level of success not the success that i really really want in life but i have a level of it and i feel like i be wanting a fam oh shit my titties out i be feeling like i be wanting a family you know my own family and stuff like that so it just be weird to me a little bit sometimes and then it's like people that have like families always want like a level of success or they want to start their career or something so it's like it's kind of hard to have both so if anybody out there has both it's like you're extremely blessed <laughs> because it gets lonely being like a entrepreneur it does <laughs> my mom be playing all the time but shit for real well i guess god wouldn't give me something that he didn't think i was supposed to have yet or he wouldn't give me something he's not gonna give me something he don't think i'm ready for yet so that's understandable. Oh, y'all. I be going through the motions, bitch. So, I basically am sitting in, like, the little hotel. The little hotel. Basically, I'm sitting in the little hotel. And... Let me make sure I'm right. Okay. Okay, so I'm sitting in the little hotel. And basically, like, I'm over here just debating, like, um, I had seen something on the shade room. And... It was showing ghost y'all remember the show called the power and it was like ghost and his wife and if y'all know what they look like what she looked like please go look her up yeah okay so how do y'all feel like people keep saying that looks don't matter but be honest like if you're not satisfied some type of way in your relationship then it's not gonna work like i feel like yeah you can say oh i don't care if the person is it's not all about looks it's not all about looks true your bitch don't have to be a 10 out of 10 but i feel like you have to have some type of attraction to that person i can't see myself dating somebody with clearly only having the only type of attraction is mentally like yes I can have I've met people that are mentally beautiful cool, but I have to have some type of physical attraction to something Physically like if not, I'm not gonna be satisfied like I know I'm not the only person that feels like that Like I feel like what do y'all think like do you feel like you have to have like you feel like that? You can this person could be a complete like you have no Physical whatever attraction nothing 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 at all and that person has a good heart so you just feel like you're gonna be okay with that like i feel like yes like i said everybody doesn't have to be a 10 out of 10 don't get me wrong but i just feel like it's no way in hell that people can really be maybe it is true but i feel like that leads people to cheating or looking at other people finding attraction from them and things like that like i just personally feel like with me i i i just I gotta it gotta be something like I can't look at that person and be in disgust like and that's no shade Let's we are being adults here like I can't look at somebody and just be like oh my god I have no type of attraction to you but your mental is a good like that I'm not even trying to be shallow like I'm being dead ass like how does that work have you ever dated somebody that you have no physical attraction like I'm gonna be honest okay so it was this guy a long time ago that I was dating and I was a baby don't get it wrong I was literally like low-key a baby and this nigga was like a drug dealer and all that other shit and I thought he was like I didn't think he was like amazingly like beautiful but I thought he was like cool like I was like oh I like his swag I like the way he dressed of course he was getting money so I like that then I like the fact that he was just like chilling you know I just like that like the way he was 
And then after talking to him, I kind of grew to like him more. And then his looks was like, just, they they were more, I was more attracted to them. You know what I mean? And then, like I said, I've dated guys before when I was way, way, way younger. But I'm just saying, like, I feel like, I feel like if you start really fucking with a person's mental, some part of you have to think that, maybe some part of you begins to think that their physical is cute, even if you didn't start off thinking that way. Like with me, personally, when I would date guys, I would not go for party guys. Like I would like guys that look hardcore, rough, like I'm talking about Rick Ross looking, looking niggas, and I would be like, hey, I'm cute, I'm the doll, I'm, I'm looking pretty with this ugly ass nigga, but I thought the nigga was fine as fuck. Like my friend, she is like that too. Like she would think that niggas is she be like, I don't like me no cute nigga. Like, I want my niggas to look ugly. But when she said it, she was just meaning like, she want her niggas looking rough. She want niggas with like a, like a, they got scars. Like, that nigga look like he been through what the fuck he looked like. But that nigga still swaggy as fuck. Like, I know people can relate to that. And with my girls, like, I feel like I'm opposite. Like, I like my girls to look really pretty. Um, yeah, I want them to be masculine. But I like them to look like beautiful. If they were to be a female but also it's either way i don't want nobody to, i personally don't want to buy in the middle like i either want you like it's it's so weird it's hard to me to explain either i want you hella pretty and you like masculine or if you're not all that cute shit, take it like bitch, cool but i feel like i have to have some type of attraction whether physically whether it's the way you look you're just really clean the way you dress your body looks or just something physically I have to be attracted to or I just will not be content with with that like I feel like I'm dating now to be well I'm dating now kind of to be like a hoe like I just do what I want fuck around and talk with who I want to so in about a year or so I'm gonna be trying to date to be serious but right now I'm just <laughs> you know I don't know what y'all think I don't know honey I tell you what the fuck is this bitch over there listening to all that fucking music for? Like, she about to be in whole love. Shut that shit up! Let me stop being mean. I need to be in here trying to get my sexy on. But I don't know. Y'all, that shit was hilarious. But I just want to touch on that real quick. Video on this vibe will be up shortly. Please wait on it.